Hello everybody, Lord Anders Darix here, and today we are back again with our first episode of Season 4. Let's go. Now, I'm kind of excited for this because I've been really waiting to see Season 4 come out. And I'm hoping to make Season 4 go really smooth for all of you guys, okay? Now, we're back in our 2DS. Um... I chose the 2DS because I like it a little better than the the, uh, two, the 3DS. Because um, we did part 70 and 71 on the 3DS with a different camera. And you know, it was iffy. But I'm not going to use the other camera because it didn't come out as perfect. It didn't come out as good as I wanted. But season 4, I want to make it as perfect as possible. So, we gotta start off this perfection with the... Uh, oh. Okay, so we gotta cross the... Cross the river. And we get to fight trainer. Who is it? Swimming alone, swimming alone. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at its Kool-Aid, man. Oh, yeah. I'm not gonna say that name. I think they ran out of names. Quillfish. Quillfish. Okay, so uh, Charizard is weak against water type, so we're gonna Mega Evolve and then use a Wing Attack. Well, we're just gonna use the power of Mega Evolution mixed with our ability of pure power leveling. And look at it, look at him. That is power right there. Wing Attack. It will either. Do very little or just enough. Just enough. There we go. Quillfish is gone. Ooh, how much experience do you have? 554. Pretty decent. I'm gonna just one shot him. Oh, we're, we're gonna we're gonna use uh, we're gonna keep up with my Charizard here. And we're gonna use wing attack because I believe that's a fighting in water type. I could be wrong. We're gonna see if it's super effective, it's a fighting in water. Oh. I was wrong. So very wrong. Oh, why didn't you just a water type move? Didn't do very much. I mean, it's a water type Pokemon. I'm a flying type, and it looks like you know rock type moves. You could have used rock type move, which is it's about fire. You know, there's so many different ways you could have beat me. The CPUs in this game are just so stupid. Stupid Obito. Yeah, I know. Defeated Swimmer, though. Who's in the battle with my binnacle? Oh, no! Oh, no. Seems like he's not the Kool-Aid Man. Too bad. Kool-Aid Man would have been fucked. But no. This guy's kind of bland. Can't blame him, though. Okay. Here we are on this beach here. Here we go. See, see I have a knack for finding these things. We've officially crossed the water, and now we're over here, and we're gonna... We're gonna fight this guy over here. I grew tired of the city of life and decided to wander the world. I'm not aiming for anywhere in particular. Oh, that's it. What, what is his crazy name gonna be? J Joran. Joran. You know, what, you know what, at least I can pronounce it. At least I can pronounce it and be like, sounds good enough. Sometimes I just can't pronounce these names, and it's like, you feel bad, but then you're like, yeah, whatever. Okay, so we're going to switch Charizard out for Lucario for the next part of this Let's Play. But we're going to use Wing Attack one more time. Just beat this Lanoon. Bam. Done. All set. Let's go. Three, two experience points. Pretty, pretty decent, you know? I like it. I really like it. The fact is, this game is so fun. Because the CPUs are so easy to beat. Because they lack common sense, or, um, the knowledge of... They can't grasp a concept that children can grasp. Which is kind of funny. But yet again, kind of sad, but, you know. So we're going to put Lucario up here, switch it with, uh... Charizard. I feel like I want to show off Lucario because we just got him and 
You know, if he stays behind, he's going to be all lonely, and, you know, where's the fun in that? Ooh, what's going here? Ooh, cool, skiddo. Nice. Let's go into this house. Who are you? Hello, small child, what's up? I love skiddo so much, I feel like I've been hit with the attract move. Here, take this TM so you can see how I feel. So, so, you are attracted to Skiddo, meaning you have feelings for a Pokemon. Wow. Just, 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 wow. I'm, I'm actually kind of disturbed now, because, you know, Pokemon are like... Oh, ready, ready? You can't pick up items from the ground while on the back of a Skiddo. Which would be poor manners, after all. I mean... I, I can see myself picking up items, but, you know, so, yeah, I guess I can see your point. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna, we're, we're gonna, we're gonna try to ride one of these skid up. Oh, whoa, well, this is actually really fun. Let's go up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so we gotta just get off here. B button. Oh, yeah, there we go. Good. Okay, so I'm going to end the Let's Play. Not here, I'm just kidding with you guys. I like messing with you guys. You know how I am. I promised I'd make longer content, and I'm going to live up to that promise, because, you know, I'm going to deliver this quality content to you guys. But look, look at this, look at this running around with the skiddo. Watch me run. Gotta go fast. Do, 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 do. Gotta go fast. Do, 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 do. What? Wait, what? I can just... Okay. No, I, I don't... Oh, I can't jump, so I'm stuck in this area. Okay. Okay, everybody, well, I'm gonna end the Let's Play here. Just because I want to show you guys part of Skid Out, and I'm gonna title this one um, beginning of Season 4, so the next title I want to make Riding Skiddo or something to do with Skiddo for the next Let's Play. So please like and subscribe for more amazing season 4 content. Thank you and have a wonderful day.